Big Bang Misconceptions. The idea of the Big Bang has a lot of people worked up. And a lot of that working up is really based on misconceptions. So one misconception is that the Big Bang is like an explosion filling empty space. But as we found out, the Big Bang created space. Space wasn't here to fill up with exploded material. There was no empty space because there was no space. And although it was certainly energetic, explosion is probably the wrong word to use when talking about the Big Bang. The idea that the Big Bang is somehow related to the formation of our solar system or the evolution of life. This is confusing time scales. Big Bang, that was roughly 13.7 billion years ago. Formation of the solar system that was about 4.5 billion years ago. Uh, the first life forms, I see different values, but roughly 3.8 billion years ago. Uh, the first people, as we think of people, was about 200,000 years ago. Obviously a lot of different life forms in between the first life and people, which is what evolution deals with. So obviously these things did not all happen at the same time. So when we're talking about the Big Bang, we're only talking about that very initial event that started our universe. These later events are completely different subject areas within science. Something was here before the Big Bang. Well, we found out that the Big Bang created time. So the concept of before does not apply. Stephen Hawking, who uh, very famous physicist, astrophysicist, has a wonderful quote. Asking what was here before the Big Bang. is like asking what will you find one mile north of the North Pole. Obviously, you can't go any farther north than the North Pole. You can't go any earlier in time than the Big Bang. Questions about things beyond the Big Bang don't fall under the realm of science because we can't observe it. We can't measure it. We can't test it. So that becomes a philosophical question or a religious question but it is not a scientific question. So the Big Bang uh, has a lot of ideas that people confuse. Uh, so hopefully this helps to clarify some of those misconceptions.